So, this is my neighborhood where I grew up. It's only 20 minutes from downtown Helsinki. A very quaint, small little idyllic suburban area or section. I reckon my parents and I, we have been here for 20 years or so. I mean, obviously I live abroad now, or I have lived abroad for for a long time now, but yeah, I still love this place to bits. And it's like, in case you guys can't tell, I've been flying, I think eight hours now, and I was only able to sleep maybe, I don't know, maybe two hours, not even that. I had a few small glasses of champagne in flight. Yeah, so I have only slept for a few hours today, uh, connecting here. So if I do look tired, it's because I am. I'm on my way to uh, the supermarket, even though it's Sunday, to get something to eat. I'm like, oh my God, there are so many people out, out and about, and it's Sunday. I'm like, <laughs> no, kind of, not really used to, I mean, I, 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 I don't know. Yeah, Helsinki, so, I mean, Helsinki is obviously not New York, and Helsinki is not London, but, but still, even the, my tiny, tiny suburb, I'm like, there's so many, so many people around. It's like, it's Sunday. Like, people should be in their countryside houses, in their country cabins. It's like, what are they doing here? Exactly. A group of people having a barbecue party. <laughs> and I'm like, the weather is not too bad. Um, so now it's like plus 18, plus uh, 22, 21 daily. And my sister's fiance is ecstatic. He's like, yeah, this is just the perfect temperature. And I'm like, oh, I, 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 I miss that, you know, having that heat wave, 33 degrees. It's pleasant, like definitely pleasant. Ple pleasant. I don't, whoa. what am I doing? So you can't see, but even me, I just have a hoodie, hoodie on and a, and a cute skirt. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely gonna close up this soon, getting cold. I'm used to much warmer climate now. Okay, so I got my my switch and I thought my game uh, had arrived as well. Well, it has, but I reckon it's stuck in customs. So I need to go there tomorrow back to the airport to uh, pay the customs fee for my new game. Well, it's okay. I got strawberries, strawberries and raspberries. Okay, so it's time for time for lunch. I just wanted something really like nice and simple, um, instant stuff almost. And um, I'm a vegetarian, so that's tofu, a little bit of salad. And these are spinach pancakes. They're ready made. And on top is lingonberry jam. Really, really delicious. And then there we have the lovely finished strawberries and raspberries. So I have got my um, Nintendo Switch in here. Um, and so, yeah, so the, the, the thing is Nintendo Switch, like this is ridiculously expensive. Um, oh my God, gaming tool, <laughs> no. Console, ridiculously expensive console. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow. 
I play um, Otome games, which are Japanese uh, visual novel games. And I just got a new game and it's stuck in customs. <laughs> so I have to go and pick it up tomorrow. But yeah, that's why. Uh, I'll, I'll get back to that later. But that, that was why, because this game only went on Nintendo Switch. It didn't come on PS Vita. So I was like, Arr! and I told myself, I'm not going to buy that game. I'm not, I'm not. I, I, I have given that company enough money already. But no, then I saw pictures of the game and reviews and whatnot. So I was like, yeah, I, I have to buy it. Later. So, finally, finally got this puppy. And yeah, I have my panty and stocking. I s hold it, whatever you want to call that thing. I, do, I have no clue. I just, I got this because, as I mentioned, this game, Diabolic Lovers Chaos Lineage, it came on Switch only. So, ah. but I must say, the, the graf graphics on this one are insane. And basically, this is what I'm, I'm going to be doing for the next few days. <laughs> ah! Jeez. Okay, I'm going, I'm playing, I'm going. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Day two. So as you can see, it's raining outside. Beautiful summer in Finland, yeah? <laughs> we did have a heat wave some time ago, but it's gone. And we are gonna have guests next week. So I'm planting flowers. White flower, white flowers. Mm. And this one, I did this one already. Day three. All right, so I'm downtown Helsinki. I'm here to meet with my grandmother. And like yesterday when it was raining, today it's sunny and plus 25, which is <laughs> quite unbelievable to be honest. I, was, I wasn't expecting the, the warm weather to come back, but it did. Ah, Hydro Cafe. But it did, and I'm very, very happy to get that. I can get those summer feels. I can see my grandmama.
few moments later. So, dinner, lunch, 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 lunch in Helsinki. So my friend Ella is holding the holding the camera. But yeah, Ella is a, is a, is a chef and a foodie. So when I come to Helsinki, I trust my dinner and lunches in her hands. So she knows food, I do not. Um, so we are at the, the dockyards, which is near the bay, one of the bays in Helsinki. And this is my lovely, lovely tofu, tofu veggie, veggie dish, which looks incredible. And the portion is, is, is humongous. I'm not used to these kind of portions in Helsinki. In Helsinki it's very typical, the prices are high, but the portions are like minuscule and then you pay so much money. But this is incredible. Also, we got a bottle of Tempranillo from Spain, 2017, rather young wine. But looking good. Ah, it's the same thing. That's 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 humongous. That's huge. Like that's a proper portion. So we got a hard rock cafe in 2012. It took us that long. And yeah, we we have been here several times here, yeah? several times drinking here, yeah? but yeah, in the summer times they have terrace, so yeah, it's actually really nice. This is downtown Helsinki, like really downtown Helsinki. And it cheers! So, this is my friend Ella, and uh, we have been friends for 10 years. Yeah. 10 years, we met in university in England. Maybe actually 11, 2008. That's no, right, 2008. 2008, yeah. And we are both from Helsinki, technically, yeah, from Helsinki, and we met in university in England. So it's quite uh, a <laughs> long, long time. Long time, yeah. It's, it's easy, easier to stay in touch with your friends through Facebook and Instagram and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So we had, had lunch earlier, and Ella is a chef in Helsinki. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> working, um, working as a chef, trained chef. But in university you studied geography? Actually, environmental management is the correct term. Mm. Yeah. Environmental management, yeah. yeah. And then change, uh, you change careers. Yes, exactly. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. Found my passion, so to say. Yeah, and like if you, if you saw my, my Big Eyes um, review, I mentioned that as an artist it's very unusual for, you, for us to find jobs after training, after university and art school. It's kind of like the same thing, wasn't it? Mm, that to yeah. find a job in your field. Yeah, exactly. Especially in Finland, you have to know the right people mm. in the environmental sciences to mm. like get a job. Mm. And it's just very difficult if you don't yeah. know anybody. Yeah. But in your case, it was a good thing that you really you, you enjoyed food and cooking and yeah. uh, culinary stuff, that you found a new passion. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 We talked about this earlier, that I was asking her, like, do you feel sad that you went through all this training and education and you are not you know working on your field of you know the field you chose or something like that but you said no yeah absolutely not yeah it's great to do what you want to do mm. but, but yeah so we, I'm, I'm back and we are enjoying our time together and definitely you will see us next week when I have my champagne party every time I, I come home I throw my usual champagne <laughs> yeah. party like very very exclusive champagne party yeah but those are great those are great yeah you, 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 and you are, you, are, you are invited yeah to my champagne party next week <laughs> See you there! And that would be the Cathedral of Helsinki. Rather beautiful. Super cute. Minna Parikka, she's a Finnish shoe designer. Ah, oh, no! How much? These are so elegant. Yeah, oh! How much? Ah, oh, no! <laughs> how much? Ah, oh, no! <laughs> now, now I want to buy them. Ah! 